Their first home game is scheduled in just about two weeks or so, but it is likely the Junior Brahmas may have to sit that one out after someone stole most of their football equipment. The night team's Devin Clark spoke to some of the heartbroken kids affected by the crime and shares the message the coach has for the crooks. How do you feel knowing that they stole all your equipment? Sad. Whoever stole a trailer from a parking lot on Rogers Road near Military Drive may not realize they robbed dozens of kids of most of the supplies they need for a much anticipated football season. All our helmets and our pads that we need. All the pylons for each end zone. All the markers on the sidelines that tell you 10 yards, 20 yards, 30 yards, all of our, our down our 10 yard chains. And that's not all. Tents, tables, coolers, the famed blow up the players run out of, and even cheerleading equipment, all gone too. I'm not gonna bring it back. The owner of the Junior Brahmas Football League, Ray Akins, says the theft happened sometime between Saturday and Sunday. Drove in, no trailer. The thief leaving behind nothing but pieces of the trailer's broken tow hitch lock. Anger? Mad, very, very, very angry. Uh, started thinking things like, you know, who would take this? Did they even know what was in it? Aiken says without most of their equipment, they may have to cancel their first home game. Which through concession stands and admissions fees helps bring in revenue needed to support them throughout the season. I was really shocked. That stuff that was really important to all of us. As for whoever's behind this. I hope that you have in your heart to return it, and if not, karma bites you like you beat these kids. See you, karma. Aiken says including the trailer, the team's losses are estimated to be between 15 and 20 thousand dollars. Now there were surveillance cameras that may help police find the thief, but in the meantime, if you have any information on who did this, you're asked to give police a call and preferably sooner than later because the first home game is scheduled for September 15th. Steve Myra.